We are live at the Auburn Medical Group with Jason, who is a medical student for this term. And we also have Dennis, our patient. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm doing it backwards. Mm -hmm. So let's switch this around. I'm Dr. Mark Vaughn. This is Jason. And this is Dennis. So Jason, let me hand that to you. And we will get started with Black Hats. And go ahead and let us know how many people are watching and what it is they're saying. And do you know where the uh, tool is? Um, I don't know. I will go grab it. So we want to, uh, actually, can I have you run into the office to grab it while I show what we're going to be working on here? A little preview of some, some blackheads here that some of our, and Kathy's watching. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be responding I will be responding to the people who comment. So I did see Kathy Seiskas here, um, but I, I'm going to um, do something right here to change what it sounds like. There we go. And traces. There we go. So go ahead and have those in. And the way the mic is, I should be able to uh, talk from this side of the mic. Okay. So yeah, get, get really close there. We don't worry about stuff getting on the camera. Mm -hmm. All right, which ones do you want to do? You have a number of them, Dennis. I have lots. My, my daughter goes crazy when she can get me. Your daughter likes getting them? <laughs> yeah, she just starts from yeah. the top and goes down. That's kind of what we're doing with the uh, alcohol bite here. Let me get another one. Yeah. Got over 100 people watching already. Excellent. Yeah, they like this sort of thing. Make sure you read their comments. That's a, mm -hmm. that's nice so we can talk to our fans. They enjoy it with us. There, that's a little cleaner. Robert says thank you. Who does? Robert. Oh, Robert. There you go. Okay. All right. Well, we are glad you're watching. Oh, Deborah Wonker's here. Very good. Okay. So... Let's get as close as we can. And of course, mm -hmm. the people watching will tell you, get closer, get closer. Oh, look at that. Get as close as you can and it still focuses, but also stand over that way so the light can... Uh... Well, it's hard to have both light and camera close, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So we'll do our best. Not getting much with that end, but the other end is too big. Well, let's give it a try anyway. I expect it won't work as well, though. How are you doing with all that pressure there, Dennis? I'm okay. Yeah, we're... A lot of people want to help. They want to help? Yeah. They want to push on? Are, I don't know how the reflection is. Are they able to read that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right there. Or can we get close enough? Yep. Was that her name or is that the title? That's her name. Yep. I'm thinking when it's really hard to see, especially with the lighting. Let's see. Let me have you come more from that side as we have Dennis kind of turn a little bit this way. So you get a little more light. I'm gonna I'm gonna go like this for this one. And again, uh, have it more from this angle here. Oh yeah. There's the first one. Yay. Look at that. A lot of keratin, maybe a little bit of sebaceous material. Maybe we can do that with this one. What do you think? Well, that one worked right away. Extractor. I can't extract it from the extractor. Ah, well, <laughs> it's still here. You guys tell Dr. Pimple Popper to get a, a self cleaning extractor. Let's do a big one. How about this one? Can you guys see that one? Mm -hmm. Dennis, I feel sorry for you. You've never been able to see this. No.
Well, the big one was actually not as exciting as one of those smaller ones. But it was still neat. A lot of people want you to squeeze them. What's that? A lot of people want you to squeeze them. They want me to squeeze them like, like this? Yep. With, I, I don't actually squeeze or push in. I don't like that um, technique. I like to kind of use lateral traction like this instead, which a lot of people will argue, oh, that doesn't work as well. But I don't know. It seems like it's, it's not as traumatic to the tissue. Mm -hmm. Or they want you to puncture them first. Puncture them. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Some people will do that. You know, it might work to get like a 30 gauge and do that. Let's see what it does. How are we going to get more light? I guess we'll just have to back up the light. Dennis, are you okay with backing up? Can we get more light on it? There, does that, does that make it more visible? Yeah. Didn't get it all though. See how far in it is? Boy, Dennis, I didn't know they were gonna be that, uh, that deep. Switch to the other side here. This is 50 years old, so. They're 50 years old? <laughs> yeah. All right, they, they want me to do this technique? Mm-hmm. Or actually, they're more like uh, 60. 60-year-old 60 60 blackheads? That's the last time these were done? Your daughter hasn't done them since then? Oh, no, no, no. She, she does them all the she time. She does them all they, the time. They just still, not all the time, but when they can get a hold of them. So there's another technique of coming in from the sides, pushing in. It looks like the chat is just blowing up. Let them know that Super Chat is available if they want. Oh, if if there's a Super Chat, like a, a chat that really stands out mm -hmm. and has a color bar around it, make sure we draw attention to that one. Okay. How are you doing there, Dennis? Sounds like it's hurting. Oh, did you see that one? That was pretty. Look at that. I don't want to get stuck in there. I just want to show it. Do they like that one? <laughs> so what are some of those comments that are going by so fast? Mm -hmm. Nothing right now. Yeah, a lot of people want you to poke them first. They want me to poke, poke them, huh? and extract. Dennis, you want me to try that technique where we poke it? Do what you need to do. Okay. Well, you guys go ahead and uh, entertain the troops while I grab a 30 gauge. We'll give that a try. How you doing? I'm good, good. All right, I'm holding up. Yeah. I'm 74, so I've had this done in March. <laughs> Been through a lot worse. Well, it's always the same. <laughs> and what made you come in today? No, what? What year are you in medical? I'm a third year. Good for you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it took like a year and a half to go. Wow. And is this considered an intern of sorts or what? Uh, a rotation. Okay. Yeah, so the family medicine one, I got seven this year. Okay, if anybody's asking, I'm getting a... a, a 30 gauge needle. Clean off our instrument between sessions. And I'm putting it on the end of a uh, one cc syringe. Of course, you can't hear anything on this side. A lot of people are asking about the cyst. Uh, we're saving that for later. <laughs> yeah, All right. Let's so, see what this is going to do. So maybe we'll just kind of. So is this what they're asking about? Mm -hmm. Does this satisfy the uh, the masses? Some people. Some. All right. Let's see if we get anything more. Having used that, 
Well, I don't like that. Look at that. There's blood when you do it that way. Well, there can be blood from this too, but. Whoa, did you see that? Mm -hmm. I wasn't even trying to do that. Didn't even see that. Where is that coming from? Let's see if we can get more. Wow. Unexpected, wonderful things. That's awesome. Now, where did this Dr. Pimple Popper come from? Oh, you've heard of her? I've heard that before somewhere. Let's talk about this one. So, uh, Dr. Sandra Lee, a dermatologist in Upland, California, was uh, making videos on YouTube of her pretty much doing exactly what we're doing here. Oh, okay. And she, she would just do it all the time. And, and other procedures, too. And she just blew up on YouTube. And so uh, later, she got herself a uh, collagen show that she has right now, currently. Oh, I, got I, I don't know what channel it's on, though. Oh, that's a good one there, Jenna. Oh, very. Let me put this down. And then do you want to explain the rationale for leaving the cyst for, alone for now? Okay, so, so the cyst. Uh, go ahead and show the cyst. So we had a conversation about the cyst. We could do that now, and we would get a lot of drainage from it, uh, but because the capsule is just shredded uh, when you do that, you can only get out pieces of it. You can't get it out intact, and when it heals over uh, that incision you make and all the wound, the, the cyst reforms, and then you have a cyst again. But at that time, once it reforms and it's not hot, you can get it out intact. So if we just leave this here, the pain will go down, and in a few weeks, Dennis could come back and have it taken out intact. If it's really painful, then we'll, we'll offer it to patients to go ahead and do it right then on the spot. But Dennis chooses not to. Let's see. I didn't feel like the uh, the needles added anything to this. And some people are saying use a blade instead of a needle. A blade? Oh, okay. All right. So no, you don't. So getting more <laughs> blood out of it. Nope. Yeah, I, I think I agree with De uh, Dennis there. <laughs> <laughs> So many shoes from Dennis. I don't think we're going to get them all. Yeah, I bet you're not. So Dennis, um, there is no charge for the uh, blackheads. This is just for fun. <laughs> oh my! I, I hope you knew that. I don't know. I guess they can't really see that. But... You know. Yeah. They're... We're just doing it for fun. The insurances don't pay for that sort of thing. Oh. Wow. Yeah, but you came to the right place apparently. Are they voting on which one they want? Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> Let's come around this way. I'm glad you're having fun, Dennis. Well, I'm just happy to have some of those gone. That's really nice. How do you feel that? 
what are they saying? Mm, someone's uh, someone's going to sleep. Someone's going to sleep. Yeah, they're saving for the big ones. They're waiting for the big ones. Mm-hmm. Alright, it's, it's out. No super chats? Mm -hmm. Also, uh, the ones that have a little Auburn Medical Group logo on them, we, we need to read those. Okay. Like, uh, I think Deborah Walker has one. from Portola. Keep saying she's going to come by the office. <laughs> Alright, sometimes these little ones are interesting, so we'll, we'll get a couple of them. Boy, they evacuate pretty efficiently there. How about these three? A row of three of them. Oh, yeah. I wonder how that shows up. Are they even able to see it, do you think? Um, I think it's so. Not, it's not really magnified. Wait for the big ones, huh? Mm-hmm. Like this. Ooh. Ooh. Someone says hello from Wales. Oh, yeah, we have. Is it... Uh, Julia. Who? Julia. Um, yeah, in when? Mm-mm. Oh, okay. Someone else. I don't know how to pronounce that name. Okay, look at that one. Look how big that one is. That came out of that. You saw it here. There's another big one. Oh, look at that. Now this one is, is bordering on being a, a dilated pour of whiner. Those we usually do use uh, blades on. Yeah, from Northern Ireland and from UK. Oh, excellent. Very good. Just probably get kind of late there. All around the world, Dennis. All righty. People in the Wales and the UK are watching. Wow. There's another good one. How about this one? Can they see that one? Yeah. Finding one that we really want. Let them choose. Let them choose. <laughs> <laughs> Are they directing us? Let's see. Oh, how about this? Can you see that one? Mm -hmm. Right there? Yep. All right. It pushes down into the shadow when I... Yeah, there it is. That's someone from Alberta, Canada. Alberta, Canada? Mm -hmm. Do they get blackheads in Canada? I'm sure they do. Any others? And I know there's a lot of small ones. Oh, right here. Look at that. Again, bordering on a, a dilated pour of winer there. Do they like that one?
He's been from Las Vegas. Las Vegas. People from all over the place watching. Blackheads. Live blackheads. How many of the other pimple popper doctors on YouTube do them live? Is this kind of a unique thing? I don't know. I, I don't spend that much time watching <laughs> blackheads on YouTube anymore. Not that I never have. And the only time I get to watch Dr. Pimple Popper is when I'm at a hotel and we get those channels she's on. That one was a little disappointing for how big it was. Is it Oklahoma and Indiana too? Indiana, Oklahoma. Oklahoma. How about Baja, Oklahoma? Anybody from Texas? <laughs> We've had some people from Texas before. Of course, when you take comments like that, I probably won't have them anymore. Oh, we got a Sweden. Sweden. Very nice. Well, this is interesting here. That probably would need a, a slit. We're not going to do any slits today, so we might save that for another day. Like maybe when we do the uh, cyst in the future. And they want to see all the plugs when you're done. All the plugs. Oh, yeah. Well, show them now. All right, this is what we got. Oh, I didn't realize you were hiding so many good ones over here on this left shoulder. Oh my goodness, look at that. That's just uh, cute. Oh yeah, look at that one. Merry Christmas, viewers. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> 438 viewers. That's pretty good. Pretty good for live with no uh, announcement that you're doing it. So where are all these people coming from? Are they all telling their friends or people just searching YouTube or it comes up on their feed? or? You got a lot of respect for Dennis. <laughs> they have a lot of respect for you. Mm-hmm. You're not crying. No. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis, how do you feel about having 400 people watch you go through this? I don't mind. If it, <laughs> it helps somebody or whatever. It's well, this, this actually is truly, purely enter entertainment. That's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's not helpful. <laughs> We're not making the world a better place here. Yeah. Uh, we might with some of our medical videos, but. But if we can give somebody some entertainment, maybe that's worthwhile, huh? Yeah, mm -hmm. we know that one's there, but we're, we're not doing that one today. A lot of people following the channel, got the notifications. That must be how it happens. Yeah, we have 200,000 followers, or subscribers. So, uh, and as far as the ones that enable notifications by hitting the bell icon, uh, that's in the tens of thousands. So yeah, a lot of people would, would get something across their screen. So there's a lot of little ones here. Not not as not as big as uh, the ones we've done up to this point. Yeah, it's all. Then if someone offers you some pulled pork if you go out to North Carolina. Pulled pork? Mm-hmm. What are you going out to North Carolina anytime soon? No. <laughs> That's it. I can see the ones in the front when you get them. Well, that's why. Yeah. Somebody's already on it. Oh, that one there. Big zips. Can it pop into view there? I 
think I might be moving over to the other side after Peter said it. Don't you? I think I am. Oh, I think there's more to it. Port. A lot of people watching this be at the end of the day after a long shift. Oh yeah, that's right. It's after hours in the East Coast. After a long shift, I like to come home and watch Dennis's bat get popped. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is entertaining to you as it is to them. Who are these people that are watching my back? I got your back. So, so last night it was the vice presidential debate. Tonight, it's Dennis's back. <laughs> nice to know that we can compete. Maybe the back is more entertaining than it could be. Probably. <laughs> I bet it is for some. More satisfying. <laughs> Look at that. Boy, you get long comments there. You got 22 on the, 22 of the little things on the Table, and then you have a couple in the. Are oh, you counting them? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like there's about 23, 4, 5, 6 that I can see. Or 26. String them here. Yeah, people like Dennis is back over the debate. They do. Yep. Well, that uh, that string of them is proven to be why well, I just knocked it over there. Oh, did you see that? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Look at all that. Can I get in here? All that came out of there. <laughs> yeah, people like that one. They like that one. <laughs> they like that one. And their neighbor. Maybe we'll try the, the, the other side on this one. I'd be surprised if they can see this because they have to go so deep. What are they saying? So they're asking why you're taking the heads off when I just leave them um, under the skin. You leave these under the skin? Mm -hmm. yeah. We can. Dennis, you want us to leave them under the skin? What's that? The blackheads? You do what you want to do. I'm, I'm, All right. I'm along for the ride. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we, we consider blackhead removal to not be a medically necessary procedure because these aren't going to hurt you if they stay. But people like to have them taken out, so. Well, uh, it's, it's a good addition. Uh, they're what? They're, na they're nasty, if you... They're nasty? Yeah, just, um... That's why you're glad to get rid of them? Yeah. Up to 500 viewers. 500. Well, my, my, my. I don't know if I've ever had 500 live. Maybe I have. Back in the Periscope days, I may have. Dennis, does it hurt when, you, when he presses that hard? Does it hurt when he presses that hard? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now that, that will take 
I don't know if you can see it on the on the video or not, but there's like a discoloration around that. And let's see if you can get it from more of that angle so that we can get light from over here. When I was 16, that was probably a boil. Yeah. And he lanced it and drained it, and then uh, had to go back a second time and do some more. Yeah, there's there's it's like a bunch of blackheads around it. Maybe I'll do a little bit here. But it kind of looks like it's probably a dilated pore of liner. That to get it all would require cutting in, and we're not going to do that today. Get that one out of there. Let's move over here. What's the weight rating on that table? The weight on the table? <laughs> the weight limit? The rating. The rating. I think it's 300 pounds. So I'm not going to do too much around this because that that needs uh, you have to have an incision going across there to be able to get that out. I don't want to cause a bunch of inflammation if we're not going to be able to actually get all that out. Well, we're, we're, we're kind of running down. Here's one. Dennis, they really like you in North Carolina. North Carolina, that's mm -hmm. the place, man. We'll have to make our North Carolina arrangements. Now, is that Lindsay Antoine in North Carolina, or is that somebody else? Mm, I, I missed it. Okay. I just saw North Carolina. Man, these are just tough ones here. No, there it is. All right, do they see any? Oh, yeah, Lindsay's there. It is Lindsay. Mm -hmm. But you also got a couple more. See, she has, she's has. she got a little Auburn Medical Group thing. So always make sure we know when those folks are. Somewhere. And Deborah's here too. Deborah Ronker? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, she's been close to the fires. I think she had to get evacuated a few weeks back. Up there. Fifty thumbs up. Nice. Very cool. All right. Well, I think we still have another patient to go this afternoon. Mm -hmm. So we should probably wrap it up, although I, I hate to because this is so much fun. <laughs> Dennis, you okay with us uh, kind of wrapping it up here? Yeah, absolutely. You, you don't want us to do that to you anymore? I don't mind. I'm just fine. You're doing great. Let me put this over here. I think you have 30 of those little guys. Is that how many? Sitting there. Yeah, we should probably uh, turn the table again, mm -hmm. too. That's, that's impressive. That goes, that's over there. There you go. Yeah. There's one in there. Oh, oh yeah. Two. Look at that one. Let's get that down on the table. Uh oh. Did you hear it? I think they heard that across the building. Oh, there yeah, yeah, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis, thank you so much for uh, providing all those blackheads. Your little video about your game. Yeah. <laughs> Let me go ahead and, and do a little sign off here. And uh, there we go. Dennis, I got you on the camera there too. We, we just want to say thank you for joining us. And, and Dennis, thank you so much. I think you provided enjoyment to those people. I think it's better Good. than NFL. Good. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. Be sure to have uh, the little bell icon uh, click for notifications so you can see things like this in the future. Till next time, Dennis, Jason, and myself, Dr. Mark Vaughn, telling you to stay in good health.